Hello and welcome to our tutorial. We will show you an easy way to get the Minas Leaky Starter Kit from Panasonic Operational, saving you time and effort. Let's start with the first step, wiring the hardware. Unpack the starter kit. It contains all components you need for a motion control system. The CD includes a helpful wiring diagram, which shows you how the individual components need to be connected. Now we will wire the components according to the diagram. First, we connect the PLC to the Minas Leaky servo driver. Afterwards, we'll connect the servo motor to the driver. Then we use a serial cable to connect the PLC with the touch panel. Finally, we connect the PLC to the 24 volt power supply and the servo driver to the 230 volt power supply. Second, we will transfer the demo programs to the individual components. That is, we will copy the demo programs to the PLC and to the touch panel and transfer the correct parameters to the servo driver. Use our Panasonic website to download the latest version of our PLC programming software FPWIN Pro 7, the touch panel software GTWIN, and Panaterm, the configuration tool for the servo driver. Please install these programs on your computer. Next, we will transfer the demo program to the PLC. Once you have connected the computer and the PLC with a USB cable, start the programming software FPWIN Pro 7. Use the option Open Project to browse the CD from the starter kit and select the PLC program. Use the command Online Communication Parameters to select the correct settings. Then go online to start the transmission. Click OK when a message pops up. Next, select Keep Current Settings. Then click the button Compile All. Now the project has been transferred successfully to the PLC and the PLC is online. Next, connect the touch panel with a USB cable to the computer to transfer the demo program. Then start the software GTWIN and find the demo program on the CD. In the file menu, select Transfer and then All Data. Make sure that the transfer direction is GTWIN to GT. Also check the communication parameters under COM settings. When you click OK, the program is transferred to the touch panel. Once the program is transferred, please close GTWIN. 
Now we only need to transfer the parameters for the servo driver. Connect your computer and the Minas Leaky servo driver with a mini USB cable. Start Panaturn. As you can see, the software recognizes the servo driver automatically. Click OK and select Minas Leaky. From the menu, select Parameter and then Read from File to import the parameter file from the CD. Click OK when a message pops up. To save the parameters, click the button Trans for Transmit and then EEP for EEPROM. To activate the new parameter settings, switch the power supply of the servo driver off and on again. That's it, you're done! The Leaky Starter Kit is ready for operation. Use the touch panel to test all functions. The CD contains a PDF file with instructions on how to commission a system. If you have any questions, please contact our support team. Thank you very much. We wish you all the best for your first steps with Minas Leaky.